Hey guys, what is going on? Booster Kings here with another Pokemon video and in today's video we are going to be opening up some stuff from the cupboard. We're going to open up two more of these, these really, really, really cheap, uh, what, the double pack blisters that only come, like Darkness Ablaze blister things, but we're going to add some more Darkness Ablaze booster packs in the mix. We're going to add another four, so we're going to open up eight packs in total. This is going to be awesome. This is going to be a really, really cheap opening just because these things are super cheap and really, really easy to get from Target, which I've never seen these before. And something I bought the other day, just I'm just going to show you, I bought one of these. So these are the, like uh, the old Digimon Tamagotchis. This is like, this is my childhood, guys. Absolute childhood right here. This thing right here. I haven't really been paying attention to it. But me and my brother used to use these every single day. It was just like something that we would use every single day. It was our funnest thing to use. This is back from like 1997. And then these ones, I found this in like Target the other day. And I just thought I had to buy it. It was like 30 bucks or something for like a 20, 20 I think it was a 20th anniversary one, which is so cool. But yeah, I kind of wanted to give you a, bit, a quick little rundown of the room because I haven't done that yet. Actually, I haven't done that in a while. Alrighty, so quick rundown of the room. I have my PC set up here. I got a brand new keyboard and a brand new mouse. They're all, and then this as well, it lights up as well. It's really nice looking. I got my headphones over here. I'm getting new ones of those, wireless ones. Can't wait. I got my ultra wide screen. I got my little screen that, just, that usually has my YouTube and that has my editing and stuff. Face cam there, I'm gonna get, I just got my old lights set up over there, obviously. I got some stuff on the walls. There's my 100k plaque back in the day when we actually were a, a channel that could get 100k, but now now we don't have 100k, but that's okay. Then I got my setup here, so this is where you guys would usually sit. And then, yeah, it looks pretty cool. Got my shelving over here. I think I'm going to change that. Let me know what I rec what you guys reckon I should do. Should I put a bigger shelf here? Because I, I got a couch here and everything and all of that, and then I got another light there. But what should I do with that? That's that's what I'm interested in. Should I get another bigger shelf here and have it in the background? But in saying that, I am getting a green screen attachment for my chair, or for a chair, I'm getting a new chair from Secret Labs, which is awesome, so I can't wait for that to arrive. But yeah, should I, should I get a new one of those, or should I revamp it? And I got my little Pokemon card posting stuff and everything like that. And then all of that stuff up there, just all of the products that I have back from the day. But yeah, anyways, just just a thought. I thought I'd let you guys see my setup. But yeah, let's get into these packs and we'll see what we can get. Alrighty, we are back in the studio. We are. I've so I've showed you around the studio. Now we're sitting in it, and this is where we are at. I can't wait to get the green screen. It should attach straight to the back of my chair, and then I'll have it more of a facing on. So it'll be like that, but I'll just be in the corner. Like I used to be back in the day. I can't wait to go back to that. It just feels feels so much better when it's like that. But in saying that, we got some Darkness Ablaze. So we have Darkness Ablaze there, a Eternus. I think it's the, I can't remember what their names are. But then we have these two packs also. So we're gonna see what does better. We're gonna see if these two do better than these four, because, sorry, there's four there and four there. So we're gonna start off with these four. Doesn't really matter, it's just a bit of fun. I can't wait to get some packs opened up for you guys. And how how do you guys reckon I should do some pack openings up in the near future? Do you guys want to see anything in particular? I am heading to the flea markets this weekend, so hopefully we can pick up what we used to pick up, like that insane sort of stuff, the repackage everything. So we'll I'll see what I'll see what I can get and um, I'll bring you guys along with me and um, yeah, you guys can be there. So it's a rare reverse holo. I did what well, was not even paying attention. So I'll bring you guys along this weekend. Hopefully we can get out there at a reasonable time and that COVID doesn't or hasn't destroyed it because I haven't been in the flea markets in, I would dare say, be a couple of years. There is a code card for you guys. I'm going to say water energy. Oh, it's a uh, metal energy. We have a Relicanth, a Zoelis, a familiar bell, Shelmet, a Panpour, Teddy Ursa, a Rookie D, Torchic, a Aron, and a Toxicity uh, Hollow Foil. Not bad right there. Is that like a... Oh no, it's just part of the card. I thought that there... 
you guys were focusing. I thought that there was like a scratch. It still might be, honestly. Is that a scratch? Just there? Like that's, yeah, right there. I think it's part of the card, not gonna lie. But in saying that, we're gonna get into our next pack. We're not even gonna mess around with these ones. We'll get straight into them. Hopefully we can pull some Charizardness. Who knows? That's I guess what that's what we're going for in this one. So we're doing a search for the Charizard. Or a Charizard. I don't really care which one. Ooh, fire energy. That that is a good start. Clang, a Duratrix, Tap, Trap Inch, Jigglypuff, a Ducklet, Carablast, a Galarian Duramaka, a Carablast again, and a Grand Bull regular rare to finish that pack off with. Alrighty, so it's our last random pack, our last random pack out of that booster box. There is a code card. Again, let me guys know if you guys get the go the code cards because it definitely definitely helps me out leaving a comment on the videos. It's really, really, really good seeing everyone come back and get back into the swing. As I oh, just a high drag on. It, it's really good seeing everyone who I used to see back in back in the day, back in like 2017 when I used to do uploads and all of that every single day. Uh, it's really good seeing all of you guys come back, which is awesome. And all you new guys, that's really, really awesome. So, our first one. So, these ones come with... So, what these are... So, what these are, these are one Darkness Ablaze booster pack and then one bonus pack. But the bonus pack... So, it, they're technically one pack and they were $6 each. This is insane. And then the extra pack is a Sword and Shield booster pack, which is just... Like, how, how is that even a thing? Like, that that does, doesn't seem right. So we're going to see what gets better pulls, random packs, or these, I guess, cheap things. But there is a code card. Get that one out of here. We're going to say Fire Energy. Oh, pats on backs for that one. No, a really, really good one. So we have a Kingler, because all of you Kinglers out there. A Grookey, a Stobble, Rhyhorn, Roselia, a Ferroseed. A Perchin, I don't even know what that, that per, Pin Churchin, and, oh, a Victini V, nice, good stuff right there, Victini V, so that was out of that Sword and Shield uh, base set pack, nice, bring it, bring it in the, bring it in the fire, so we've already, already stomped all over the, the extra packs, Let's see if we can get something out of this other pack. There is a code card. So we've already outdone the extra packs. So this was an awesome opening so far. We have an Energy, a Staravia, Zoellus, a Pupitar, Tauros, a Rookie, a Rookie D, sorry, a Galarian Mr. Mime, a Electric, Dino, a Wishy Washy Reverse Holo, and a Ampharos Regular Rare to finish off that pack. Guys, if you really can get this video up to like 20 likes, 20 likes is easy to do. Guys, if we can get to 20 likes, that'll be absolutely amazing. Just leave a like on this video if you guys really do. If you if you guys like the videos. And I know it's it's crazy. I was looking at my um some of the stats the other day and just looking at how many people have notifications on, it's around 50,000. So just thinking about that makes me feel quite sad because 50,000 people have their like the notifications on their phone and 50,000 people would see that I upload a video but only around 200 people actually click on it so I really appreciate everyone for actually clicking on that on that video it really really helps me out hopefully we can get a few more people clicking on it and we can actually start doing proper videos because these ones I'd, I'd just count them as like normal just little videos I don't really count them as proper videos because I'm trying to get that base again I'm trying to get that, but I'm, I'm just ranting now. I'm trying to get the base again where we can actually go and start building up and building, building, building. But it's really hard to get off, off the ground again. Obviously, it's like starting a new channel. I've just got some of the uh, loyal subscribers back from years and years ago uh, coming back and to the, uh, to the videos every day. Well, those two open up very strangely. There is a, another code card. Oh, good old green codes. Can never can never get rid of them, eh? Birdkeeper, Solrock, Grimer, Clink, a Skitty, Pansage, a Golet, Bonsweet, and a Wigglytuff regular rare to finish off that pack. Guys, we 
I think, how many packs? We opened eight packs and we got a holo and a Victini V. So not the most insane pulls, but we did get, or we did get to open up some Pokemon cards nonetheless. So thank you all for watching. Please remember to leave that like or hit that like button. Subscribe if you guys are new and I will see you guys in my next Pokemon video. Peace out.